everyone, this is Ravnia's blog, and welcome to my new haul video. So this is the haul I got from the Soda City Comic Con. I went to the Soda City um, Comic Con this weekend, and I had a blast there. Like, this was actually the very first year I ever been to any Comic Con, so the Soda City Comic Con was my very first Comic Con, and I had a fun time there. Like, I get to meet a lot of great artists. I met a lot of great authors. Uh, I was able to buy a lot of awesome stuff from the um, Comic Con. And I wanted to show this stuff to you guys. Like, I got a lot, a huge haul here. So we'll probably be here all day, but that's okay. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start off with the smaller items first and then head on to the bigger items. That way, um, you know, it'll be easier for me to get through these items. And um, I really wanted to show you all the sign items I got. Now, I will admit that I forgot some of the Arthur's names. So if I forgot your name, I'm really sorry. Um, it's just... You know, this is the first year I've been to um, any Comic-Con. And, you know, I'm not used to, like, trying to remember every Arthur or every artist's names that I come across. But next year, when I go back to the Soda City Comic-Con, I'm going to try to do a better job of remembering all the artist's um, names. So that way, I won't be like, uh, I got this item signed by so-so. So, you know, hopefully I'll do better next year um, regarding that. But um, here's what I got from the Soda City Comic Con. So again, I got a lot of good stuff, and um, I wanted to show it to you guys. So let's start off with this. This is a bag, if I can get loose. But um, this is a gifted bag. So for those of you who don't know what gifted is, it's supposed to be this um new X Men TV series that's supposed to come on Fox, and I can't wait to see it. I'm really excited about gifted. So. Um, I was um, happy to get this bag, so I'm definitely going to check out Gifted. The next item I got is this new fan for your phone. So if you, like, plug this up to your phone, it's like works like a fan, and you could just, um when you turn on your phone, you could just turn on this fan and fan yourself. So I thought this was really interesting. I never had something like this before, but that was really um an interesting um, gift to get. And then the next thing I got... Of course, you know I had to get a shirt, so I did. And it's this new Marvel t-shirt I got. So it has um, the members like Captain America, Iron Man, Spider-Man. Um, so this looks pretty cool. Um, I might be wearing this t-shirt on some videos, so definitely um, a really awesome looking shirt. You know, I can't wait to wear this shirt. So that was a great gift. The next thing I got is one I'm really excited for, and that's the new Colossus um Funko Pop figure. Um, like I was like looking at it the whole time doing the Comic Con, I was like thinking to myself, should I get this Funko Pop or not? Because this is exclusive Funko Pop, and so I ended up buying it because I'm a huge Colossus fan, and even though I already had a Colossus Funko Pop, this one's a little different because you can notice you notice that his um steel skin is like. Um, actually shiny, and the other one, his skills, his steel skin wasn't really shiny, but this one is, and I thought this was really interesting, so I definitely picked this up, and I, I hope to put this uh, with my other um, Funko Pop collection. So moving on to the next thing, of course, I got some comic books. I, um, it is a comic con, so of course I got some comic books, but I got um, Spider Gwen Volume Zero, Most Wanted. So. Um, I've been hearing a lot of good things about Spider Gwen, and I wanted to try out this um, graphic novel. But this looks pretty interesting. Um, so, if any of you who've read Spider Gwen, let me know if Spider Gwen was really good or if Volume Zero was really good. So, I just picked this up, and hopefully, I can um, enjoy this um, new series from Marvel because this seems to be a series that a lot of people seem to love. So, that was an interesting gift. Then, the next graphic novel I got was. Afterlife with Archie. So I've heard a lot of good things about this um, comic book and I wanted to give this a try. I love Archie comics so of course I picked this up and I love horror too and I wanted to see how this Archie comics is going to go. I heard a lot of good things about this comic book too so I picked this up also. So moving on to the next thing and I actually got two issues of these and it's this new comic book series called Soul. Um, Now both of them said issue one but they're like about two different characters, according to what the art, or what the author told me about this um series. So I'm definitely gonna try to um read this series. Like um, looks pretty interesting. Um, the artwork looks really good in um both comics. So see the artwork right there. Looks pretty cool. And um, 
I can't wait to um actually check out this series. It looks really interesting, and I want to see um you know what kind of story we're getting into. But it sounds like an interesting series, so I'm definitely gonna read these up whenever I get the chance to. So moving on to the next thing, and of course this is like one of my most favorite things I got, but I got some bookmarks from the um comic con so of course i'm a huge book reader so i had to get some bookmarks but these bookmarks look awesome like i had to buy them so the first bookmark is the son the hedgehog bookmark which i was so happy about i never thought they have a son the hedgehog bookmark but this looks so cool you see right there so i'm definitely gonna um use this as my bookmark love this it looks so beautiful then the next bookmark i got is Wonder Woman. So this is another bookmark I was really interested in. Um, I've been loving the Wonder Woman movie so much, and I had to give me a bookmark that features Wonder Woman. So this is pretty cool. And the next one is, of course, Nightwing. I'm a huge Nightwing fan, and I'm so glad they had um, a bookmark of Nightwing. So this is uh, pretty cool. If you're a Nightwing fan, I definitely suggest pick this up if um, you love reading and you want a um, superhero um bookmark this is definitely one that's awesome and then another one i got is the supergirl um bookmark so this is pretty cool um you have a picture of kara so um i definitely love this bookmark so beautiful really shows um supergirl in um a positive light so definitely um check out this um supergirl bookmark and last, but certainly not least, and I was really surprised to see this one, and this is the Colossus and Kitty Pride bookmark. I'm a huge Colossus and Kitty Pride fan, so of course I was really happy to see this bookmark. So if you're a huge um, Colossus and Kitty Pride fan, I definitely recommend you check out this bookmark. This is awesome. I was really excited about it because I'm a huge fan of both characters, and it was great seeing a bookmark that featured the both of them. So definitely pick this up. So moving on to the um, bigger stuff, and that's the sign um, items I got. Um, for so with this one, it's like um, like I didn't have anything to um, sign it with. So um, the artist Chad Bowers um, gave a signature. He drew me a little Wolverine thing. See um, Wolverine right there. So he drew, um, he drew me Wolverine, and I was like, yay, I, I love Wolverine so much. That's such a cute drawing. So um, this came from Chad Bowers, and um, I just love this Wolverine drawing. I love Wolverine so much, and he does such a good job with it. So definitely love this um, little um, autograph he gave to me. And then the next thing I got, of course, I got some books. Um, and this is a book called Color World. Um, by the author Rachel E. Kelly. Now, I've never heard of this series before, but this is, like, a really interesting series. Like, um, she didn't sign it, <laughs> but, um, this looks like a really interesting series, so I'm definitely gonna read this series whenever I get the chance. Lovely cover, but definitely gonna read this series whenever I get the chance. So the next book, which actually was signed, is, um, a new book called Natalia, and it's written by Lillian Oak. And you can see the her autograph here. So, yeah, she signed it right here. Here's her autograph right here, which is pretty awesome. So, yeah, and I, um, it's rare that you get an author to, like, sign your books. But um, this does look like a really interesting book to check out. So I'm definitely going to um, give this book a uh, chance and see what it's like. But it looks like a really interesting book. And then another book that was also signed is a book called Fireheart by John Hartness. So beautiful cover. Love the dragon work. Um, he also um, signed this book. So right here. So here um, he got the signature. So that's pretty cool to have a book signed. And then not only that, but I also got a... Um, free bookmark to go with it so that's awesome another um cool bookmark to add to my collection so i definitely love this so i'm definitely going to give this um book a try this looks really interesting and i love the signature in it but it looks like a really interesting fantasy series i might check out so now we're moving on to even bigger ones and these are signatures from a new series called amazing age um, I got the signatures for all three of the people working on this, and they were Matthew David Smith, Jeremy Massey, and Christine Brunson, and they all um, signed both of these comic book issues, so 
I can't wait to check out this comic book issues. Um, this series looks really interesting, so I'm definitely going to give this series a try, but both of them were signed by all the um, writers involved in this work, so that was pretty awesome to have all three of them to get come together and sign this um, little um, interesting series. So, moving on to the next thing. I got a couple posters. So, um, I got this screen, um, Queen's poster. I did see p bits and pieces of the TV series itself, but it was awesome getting this um, little poster of the screen um, Queen's. So, that's pretty awesome. You see the poster and see the characters. So, that's a um, pretty awesome little poster right there. And then another poster I got was, um, of course, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. I did watch that show in the first season, but I haven't been keeping up with the show for a while, so I'm a little behind, but I was glad to get this poster anyway. So, um, really awesome looking poster of all the characters listed, so definitely love this poster. And then there's another um, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. poster that has Ghost Rider in it. So, you see um, Ghost Rider's um, character right there try to get the glare off um but yeah this is the one that features ghost rider you see all of the characters there so this is a really um awesome little poster and another poster i got is gotham so i, I, I this is another show i've been behind on i've been watching it at the very beginning but i'm kind of behind on gotham also but this is a pretty cool looking poster so yeah it's sorry if i'm showing it like that it's just trying to get rid of the glare on my computer so you can see the poster. But, um, yeah, there's the Gotham poster. And then another poster I got is the Gifted poster. So I'm really excited to check out Gifted. Um, I love X-Men, and this looks like um, a really interesting series. So here's the poster of Gifted with the big M for the mutants. So that looks pretty cool. <clears throat> So now let's get on to the sign, um, to the more autograph, um, items on this list. <coughs> Excuse me. So I'm really excited to check these, um, items out. Okay. So I had to, like, write no cards for some of them because I forgot some of these, um, people's names when I was, um, going to the Comic-Con. So hopefully next year I'll get a little better with trying to write down people's names, um, whenever they give me their signatures. But... One that I was really excited about, and that was um, a signature from W.F. Bell. Um, he's the one who plays Negan in The Walking Dead, and there was a Walking Dead panel at com and at the Soda City Comic Con. And I went there, and it was really interesting. Like, he's such a nice person to um, talk to. Like, we had a lot of great conversations with each other. So um, I got his autograph. You can see right there um, how he, what he wrote to me here. So it says, to Ron Yao, we are all Negan, um, by W.F. Bell. So this is a pretty cool poster. I really love this. So it's first time I got a signature from an actor. So that's awesome. <laughs> and then moving on to the next poster. Now, this one I got yet uh, on Saturday, but the Arthur wasn't there at the time. So I, I wasn't able to get the signature for this one. Um... But it's a poster of Black Widow, and I thought this looks really interesting. I love this um, little poster. Now, here are some two other posters with the Arthur, where the artist actually signed them. And that's of Captain America with the Soldier. You see how this looks? You see on the bottom. So this is where the um, Arthur um, signed his name right here. So that's pretty cool. Sign um, poster of Captain America. And then there's another one that's also by the same Arthur. And that's um of Bucky Barnes, also from Winter Soldier. So he also signed this poster. And um here's his signature on the bottom right here. So that's pretty awesome. So yeah, um love these two posters. I love the artwork on here. And I'm so glad that they were able to sign this poster. So the next um poster I got was from artist Barry White. And it's a poster of Storm. I love this um artwork. I'm a huge Storm fan. And I'm so glad I got a poster of Storm. It turns out Barry White is also a fan of Storm. And he's also another very nice artist to um talk to. Um, how much he loves X-Men. You know, we had such interesting conversations about the X-Men. So 
Um, I'm glad he gave me this poster of Storm since I'm a huge Storm fan. So um, this is his um, signature on the bottom right here. So see the signature right there. But yeah, um, the Storm poster looks awesome and I really like it. And then the next person I got, and I get their card out. And this is an X-Men poster I got. Love this poster. It looks so beautiful. Look at all the X-Men characters in here. It looks so gorgeous. And the person who um, did this was um, Chris McJunkin. So he was the one who um, drew these characters. It looks so gorgeous. Um, again, I'm a huge X-Men fan, and I think he drew all these characters so well. So, see all the X-Men um, characters right there. But this is an awesome um, drawing that I'm definitely going to keep. And then, last but not least, we got an artwork by um, Greg Bo Watson. And he drew this um, Avengers um, art. So, you got um, the Incredible Hulk on the top. You got Captain America in the middle. You got the Black Widow on the bottom. And um, you got his signature on the um, bottom also. So he was another artist who was very um, nice. Um, we had a lot of great conversations with each other. And I just love this artwork. I love the Avengers. And I love this um, artwork he made of the Avengers. It's so detailed. It's so beautiful to look at. So definitely love this artwork. So I'm definitely going to keep this in my um, pile soon enough. And um, that's all the items I got from the Soda City Comic Con. I really had a fun time at the Comic Con. And I hope in next year I get um, more items for my haul because I really enjoyed all these items. And I enjoyed getting um, all these um, signatures from the authors. And hopefully next year I'll keep, I'll keep up uh, a better tabs on the authors themselves, uh, the authors' names. So that way I won't be like, well, this is, um, I wouldn't be like, you know, I don't know who signed this poster and stuff like that, but I'm showing it to you anyway. So um, I had a fun time at Soda City Comic Con. I'm hoping to go back next year. Well, um, I hope you enjoyed my um, little comic book haul from the um, Soda City Comic Con. And um, be sure to follow me on Twitter so I can keep you updated and new videos will post up. And also, like my Facebook page, Ravity's Blog's Best Comments. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. This is Ravity's Blog, and I'll see you later.